With the latest firmware update, you can use the VCI400 as a standalone mixer. This update will allow you to connect CD players or turntables with a DVS interface or phone a preamp to channel C and D and mix each source with a VCI400 as a standalone mixer. If you're using Traktor, we recommend using our optimized TSI file, which takes advantage of the sample decks in combination with the standalone features. Channels C and D both feature classic mixer functions such as trim, three band EQ, and level meter. In addition, you can use the filter knob to perform high pass and low pass sweeps. If you're a PC user, download the firmware file from the VCI400 support page on the Vestax website. For Mac users, you will have to download both firmware file and the firmware updater tool. Connect the power adapter of your VCI400 to a power outlet and the USB to your computer, then switch the unit on. Open your driver control panel, choose firmware upgrade from the left menu, Browse and select the firmware file. Click Start Firmware Upgrade. Click Finish. Open the firmware updater. Click Continue. Choose Upgrade Firmware and click Continue. Click Continue to confirm. Browse and select the firmware file. Click load firmware. The update process will begin. Once the update has finished, click exit. And that's all done. Your VCI 400 is now converted to a hybrid controller mixer. Connect your CD players or your DVS interface to the line inputs on the rear panel of the VCI 400. The input routing switch must be set to DEC CD. The potential meter beside each input is the trim control Adjust the trim to set it as default position. With the new TSI file for Tractor, loops and samples can be triggered from the sample pads. This means that you can play the two external decks, such as a CD player or a turntable, along with the two decks of Tractor, in combination with the two sample decks. Ultimately, you can play six decks at a time. All you have to do is use the optimized TSI file for Tractor, available from Vestax.com.